says here how U.S. consumers help prop up the world economy. This was done three months ago, just when the bugdemic started. One of the things that happened to me in this bugdemic of staying home a lot, 99% of the time, is it broke my consumer habit. And the big thing I was consuming was once a month I would go on a trip. I'd get back from a trip and I would plan the next trip. In fact, I had like booked three trips in advance. And as soon as I got back from one trip, I would book another one. It was a habit. It was my lifestyle. Now, staying at home because of the bugdemic has broken that cycle. I do not need to go on a trip every month. Well, I can't, but it's broke that need. It's like a drug. It's like a habit. I don't need to go every month. I'm living fine without it. And what does that mean? I'm not a big a consumer as I used to be before the bugdemic. If I'm not a big a consumer after this bugdemic, then maybe a lot of Americans are not consuming, especially if they don't have a job and they got to pay a mortgage or the rent or car payment or credit card payments. Well, if the uh, the U.S. consumer is helping prop up the world economy. <laughs> the world economy is in a lot of trouble because uh, right now we are not feeding it with consumerism. Maybe it will come back, but I got a funny feeling that uh, consumerism is going to come back very slow. Anyways, it changed my habits, my lifestyle, uh, immediately.